going on? Nothing that concerns you. Just a bunch of fools trying to get themselves killed over a few dead sheep. Wolf took out a dozen last night. So you called me in here to what? Just to keep me in sight? Good evening, Red. We're just forming up a hunting party. You're hunting the wolf? Can I go with them, please? I'll be safe in a big group. Don't be ludicrous. You're staying inside, and you're keeping that hood on. You know red repels wolves. They're not wearing red. They're damn fools, too. There's only yeah, two she, more nights she left. She plays the tough and feisty granny on CTV's hit series Once Upon a oh. Time. Canadian actress and fellow North Shore resident Beverly Elliott joins us now to tell us about uh, that and her latest projects. Lovely to see you again, too. Thank you, Can't Mark. believe a relatively young woman like yourself is playing a granny, but uh, <laughs> there you go. Thank you for that. And this has been since episode one, too, so you've been in, in this series since the start, right? I was in the pilot, which yeah. was great. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I, I auditioned and got the call about five days later, and they said, oh, by the way, can you knit? And I went, uh, yes, I can knit. Meanwhile, you're on the internet going, how to knit? <laughs> drove to a knitting store, bought needles, got somebody yeah, to teach me good how to for knit. You. Yeah, yeah. How, how fun is it to, to be on a, on a show? Did you know at the time that this was going to be as popular as it's become? Because this has such a massive following. Totally and, and, massive. and it's been going for a few seasons now. So. Um, yeah, we're in season five right wow. now. Um, I had no idea. You never do. I don't, mm -hmm. I don't think the network does. They only hope, you know, we're writing yeah, something that has appeal that people are going to be drawn to. But I have to say, I had that wacky as it sounds, that full body goosebump thing mm -hmm. when I was at the audition I just went oh my gosh I think something magic is happening here mm -hmm. and uh, so and the cast is so strong like all the leads are right they're amazing Robert mm -hmm. Carlyle Carlyle's fantastic mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. everybody is so and, and is it more fun to play it's sort nice. of like a fairy tale character in, in a sense or is it uh, it's iconic. just as challenging right yeah, yeah 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 it is it is iconic and and it's cool because the fan base so many people watch it but primarily when mm -hmm. I go to the fan conventions mm -hmm. there's lots of young girls tween age 14 15 12 13 um, that just love the show and I think it's because uh, the princesses that we grew up with were just like find me a husband and I'll live happily ever after whereas here these women are warriors they're strong they fight they save their people they make mistakes and they're forgiven and so it's an interesting point it's been such an evolution in a strong sort of female character we've seen that with films like the Hunger Games Games and, and and all those types of shows too and uh, I know. Yeah, it's amazing it's yeah. great yeah. tell us a little bit about granny is she feisty is she tough is she you know she's all those tough things? and when yeah. things get really tough I get my crossbow out and I wow <laughs> Yeah, which is, I'm going to listen to you from now on. If I'm over, it's right? always funny to look at the script and go, oh, what do I say now? Because mm -hmm. in the first season, I had a couple of nice big episodes, season two, another nice one. But now mm -hmm. I'm kind of one of the townspeople. Right. Familiar face, part of the story, because there's so many cast. Mm -hmm. And we keep going off into different lands, so the cast is ever expanding. But um, I get a couple of, you know, nice kicker lines, and mm -hmm. feisty, smart nice. aleck. Right. And how nice is it for you to be a resident here in, in Vancouver, uh, filming a show in Vancouver, and a very successful show, too? Because you, you've been around, you've seen the ebbs and flows in this industry, too, and it must be nice to, to see a lot of stuff being done. I count my blessings every day. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. It's great. It's really yeah. great. And you keep yourself busy because not only that, you're keeping yourself busy, you got a new show coming out too on I do. your own. Yeah. 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 It's she, she's, this woman's very accomplished. She does, she's an actress, you're a singer, you've recorded, you do all that sort of yeah, stuff. Yeah, do you know what? It, I just have to keep the wolves away from the door. Like, <laughs> literally, you're seeing that? It's true. There you go. Yeah. I go, where else can I work? Where, yeah. Who else will Don't hire let me, me get my crossbow out. I know. Else, I, right? I, yes, the mortgage yes. needs to be paid. Yeah, tell us about the show, though. Um, well, I joined a writing group about uh, probably four or five years ago, and mm -hmm. I just started writing stories. And uh, as the group went on, it was called the Wet Ink Collective. It's still alive. Mm -hmm. um, and uh, I started writing stories, and it, then it became clear in the support of the other women in the group, all writers, playwrights, actors, uh, that there's a play forming here. And I have done theater my mm -hmm. whole life, so mm -hmm. I wanted to get back on stage again. Mm -hmm. And it's and I've also sung, and I've used to sing in bands and mm -hmm. sing in bars. And right. one of my favorite things is in between the songs, talking to the audience and right. just sharing stories that are familiar. Yeah. So that's what this show is. It's called Didn't See That Coming. Okay. And the, sto the theme is each story, I tell nine stories. There is some, I bump into a stranger or someone I didn't know or a situation that I did not see coming and have a life-changing moment. Nice. It's at the Gateway Theater? It's at the when, Gateway when, Theater when in open? Richmond. 
we open tomorrow night. Wow, good luck. Preview Break. tonight, we have our first audience. Oh, very good. Break a leg. Yeah, All right. thank you. Lovely to see you again. So nice to see, see you. Nice to see you too. And we uh, go Beverly way Elliott. Uh, you didn't see that coming. You can also watch her on Once Upon a Time, Sunday nights at 8, right here on CTV. And to watch the segment again, check out our website, CTV Morning Live.